My name is Felicia Nall Sussman, and I'm thrilled to witness nearly 450 attendees in the audience today. These impressive numbers just highlight the need and desire for the establishment of a society such as the AFS. This grassroots mission grew out of a desire to break down the silos between foregut surgeons and gastroenterologists to allow us to come together with a joint mission of consensus building and an understanding that if we truly want to move the needle on the management of foregut disorders and implement meaningful and enduring change, we need to do it together. Surgeons, gastroenterologists, and our industry partners. I've had the honor as the educational chair to work with many on the executive AFS board, including our chairman, Dr. Reg Bell, and our amazing executive director, Kate Freeman, who without this course would not be possible. They, <laughs> they all helped grow this meeting out of a well-established local course run by Dr. Sumit Mattel into a two-day course with over the next two days, you will hear from 40 or more KOL on the program. Each of the individual sessions was designed to be of high interest to both GIs and surgeons alike, touching upon concepts and controversies important to all of us. Throughout the next two days, our hope is that the meeting evolves into an interactive collegial consensus building experience. To that end, Every section has a moderated discussion at the end, nearly 30 minutes long, which is co-moderated by both a gastroenterologist and a surgeon. Our hope is that we all walk away having learned a great deal, but also with an understanding of what next steps we need to take together to ultimately raise the bar on the quality, efficiency, efficacy of our care of foregut patients. At this point in time, I'd like to introduce the president of the American Foregut Society, Dr. John Lippham. Well, thank you. Thank you for coming. Um, this was nothing less than a pipe dream uh, that we had about a year ago. If any of you have ever heard me talk before, you know I never, ever get up on the stage. But I had to, because this is unbelievable that all you people were dumb enough to come. <laughs> and so I, I've got to take a picture. So, so smile. You're not smiling in the back there. Normally, at this point, we would uh, spend about 10 or 15 minutes going over what the mission of this is. Why are we here? What is this trying to accomplish? We've already got societies that do all this. But because of time limitations and because this thing exploded way beyond what we thought, um, we're going to reserve all that for tonight's dinner. So tonight's dinner is open to everybody. I encourage everyone to come um, to hear kind of where this is going, where we see this. And so again, I'm going to keep it brief, but I just want to thank you for coming and hopefully you enjoy this. Um, and I think as Felice said, I think we can make a huge impact here by coming together and coming to some sort of collaborative treatment for reflux and foregut disease. So thank you.